2회 1번 다음을 듣고 여자가 하는 말의 목적으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hello, students. This is Ms. Parker, the vice principal, with an announcement for seniors. It's almost time to get your graduation photos taken. And this year, there's been a change. LifeTouch, the photo company, used to visit our school to take the pictures. But this year, you have to visit their studio. Their basic photo package includes three different poses of you wearing a gown and three casual poses without a gown. You need to prepare any props you would like to be included in your photos, such as flowers. Also, be sure to have your photos taken before the deadline, Friday, November 4th. For more information and details, visit the school website or the Life Touch website. Thank you. 2번 대화를 듣고 남자의 의견으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Brian, you know I started learning Italian, right? Sure. You're planning to go to Italy to study music. Right. But my Italian hasn't been improving very much. So I was wondering if you could give me some tips since you're good at foreign languages. Well, do you use a dictionary? Yes, I use an Italian dictionary. It's difficult to understand, though. I think you should use a dictionary that is suitable for your level. You mean an Italian to Italian dictionary is not good for me? I think so. It'd be more suitable for advanced learners. Beginners should use an Italian to English dictionary. I see. So, as a beginner, an Italian to English dictionary would be better for me. That's right. A dictionary that's too basic or hard for one's ability is not very helpful to get better at the language. That makes sense. Thanks for your advice. Don't mention it. Let me know if you need any more help. 3번. 대화를 듣고 두 사람의 관계를 가장 잘 나타낸 것을 고르시오. Oh, hello, Mrs. Patterson. How do you like your new kitchen? Hello, Mr. Emerson. We love it a lot. I'm so happy you like it. Is there a problem you're calling about? Actually, yeah, just a little one with the light you installed above the table in the kitchen. Oh, did it stop working? Not really. We broke the bulb while cleaning the kitchen. Oh, dear. Was anyone hurt? No, I just wanted to know where to get that kind of bulb. The shape is really unique. I see. I'll go to the lighting store and get one for you now. That'd be great. Thanks. By the way, we're really happy with your remodeling work, so we're thinking about having you also do our bathrooms. That's good news. We can talk about it later. I'll be over there with the bulb in an hour. Okay, I'll see you then. 4번 대화를 듣고 그림에서 대화의 내용과 일치하지 않는 것을 고르시오. Simon, come here and look at this picture. Okay, Alice. Wow, that's from Grandma's old farmhouse when we were kids. Yeah, we loved hanging out in the kitchen. Remember this tree outside the kitchen window? Yes, I remember that. It had beautiful flowers in spring. Look at the tray Grandma is holding in her hand. There's a cake she baked on it. That was so tasty. She made the best cakes. I agree. Do you remember this polka dot headscarf I'm wearing? Yeah, you used to wear that all the time. You're drawing at the table. You would always draw there. Do you still have any of the drawings? Yeah, 
I have a box with a bunch of my old drawings. I remember drawing this bird on the chair here. I might still have it. I'd love to see it if you do. In Grandma's old farmhouse, people and animals were always welcome to come in. Oh, I really miss that old farmhouse. Uban. Tehari did go, Yajaga Halilo, Kajang Chokjaran Gosil Kurishio. Honey, Jerry's last day at work is next week, isn't it? That's right. He's been a waiter at our restaurant for 20 years. It'll be sad to see him leave. I know. He's always so positive and helpful. Everybody loves him. For sure. Staff and customers all feel the same way. Everyone will miss him. Indeed. You're planning to throw a party for him, right? Sure. We're going to hold it after the restaurant closes next Friday. I've already ordered things for the party. Great. I'd like to do something for him, too. I can get a cake for him. Well, the chef said they'd make one. They're not bakers, but they can bake one for Jerry. That'd be great. Then I'll order flowers for the party. Good idea. They'll look nice on the tables. Yeah, so I'll go online and choose some nice flowers. Okay. 6번 대화를 듣고 남자가 지불할 금액을 고르시오. Hello, Red Bridge Bakery Cafe. Hello, Amy. This is Jason from Lakeside Library. Oh, hi, Jason. How can I help you today? I'd like to order donuts for a special event tomorrow afternoon. I need chocolate donuts and vegan donuts. How many do you need? Chocolate donuts are $2 each, and vegan donuts are $3 each. I need 40 chocolate donuts and 10 vegan donuts. Okay. Any beverages? We have bottled coffee, iced tea, and orange juice. Coffee and iced tea are $4 per bottle, and orange juice is $5 per bottle. I'll take coffee and iced tea. 25 bottles of each, please. All right. So, 50 bottles in total, right? Yes. And please deliver everything to the library event hall by 4 p.m. tomorrow. Is there a delivery fee? Yes. It's $5, but it's free if you spend over $100. Great. I'll pay by credit card. 7번. 대화를 듣고 여자가 엘산드로 호텔보다 라벨라 호텔을 추천한 이유를 고르시오. David, have you made any plans for this summer vacation? Yes, I'm going to Coral Island for a week with my family. Awesome! It's so beautiful there. Have you booked your hotel? Not yet. But I want to book a nice big hotel this time because my parents are coming too. Do you have anything in mind? Well, we're thinking of staying at either La Bella or El Sandro. They both have family suites and have good guest reviews. I've stayed at both places and they were both really nice with a beautiful ocean view. Oh, really? Which one do you recommend? It's hard to choose. Both have a variety of recreational facilities, including a private beach and hiking trails. But I think La Bella would be better for your parents. Why? They have a kid-free swimming pool. I think your parents would like it because they can relax quietly. Sounds great. I'll talk to my parents. Thanks for the advice. You're welcome. 8번. 대화를 듣고 서핑 강습에 관해 언급되지 않은 것을 고르시오. 
Hi, Abigail. What are you looking at on the Internet? Oh, hi, Daniel. I'm signing up for a surfing lesson. That sounds fun. Let me have a look. I'm taking the lesson next Saturday afternoon. Do you want to join me? Yeah, I'd love to. It's from 2 p.m. to 4 p.m. That's fine with me. Good. It's at White Beach, but that's a little far. But they offer free transportation. Look here. Oh, they have a shuttle bus. We can take it at Central Station. Right. What do you think of the tuition fee? It's $50. That's quite reasonable, since all the equipment is included. Okay. I'll sign up after you. Great. I'm looking forward to taking the lesson with you. Coupon. 호호 홀리데이 5K 워크에 관한 다음 내용을 듣고 일치하지 않은 것을 고르시오. Hello, listeners. I'm John Baker. And I'm pleased to announce that this year's Ho Ho Holiday 5K Walk will be held on December 18th. So, get ready to put on your Santa suit and dash your way through downtown Brenton with family and friends. The walk starts at 9 a.m. at Evergreen Park, and at noon, there will be a 1K race for children in the park. For those with infants, strollers are allowed on the walking course so bring them to. Online registration for the walk begins on November 1st, and the first 50 people who register get a free Santa suit. There will be music, awards, hot chocolate, and the opportunity to get your photos taken with Santa. And everybody who finishes the 5K gets an awesome Santa medal. See you there. 10번. 다음 표를 보면서 대화를 듣고 두 사람이 주문할 차를 고르시오. Honey, come here and check out Dave's Tea Store. They're selling special teas at good prices. Great. Let's order some. Okay. I love their cherry blossom tea. It tastes so good. Yeah, but we still have a lot left from our buy last time. Then let's choose one of the other types. I'm fine with all of them, but since you don't like green tea very much, let's not get that. All right, and I don't really want to order this one. It says it has a high caffeine level. Okay, so it's down to these two. Which one do you prefer? They both sound good, but this one is more expensive. It is, but I bet it's really good. And tea lasts a long time, so I don't mind spending the extra money. Then let's go with that. It'll be worth it. Okay, let's order it. 11번 대화를 듣고 여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Dad, look at this stuffed animal tiger. It's a birthday present for my friend Mina. Oh, that's cute. Does she like tigers? I'm not sure, but I bought it because this year is the year of the tiger. I hope she likes it. 12번. 대화를 듣고 남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Honey, I tried to book train tickets to visit your parents next weekend, but they're sold out. Then how about flying? I'm sure there are flights available and tickets are really cheap nowadays. Good idea. Can you look for some? 13번 대화를 듣고 
여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Honey, I'm worried because our dog Charles has been acting a little strange recently. I know. He doesn't seem sick or anything, though. I think he's just feeling a little down. Yeah. What he needs might be more exercise. Oh, I know that dog parks are opening up here and there these days. Why don't we take him to one of them? What's a dog park? It's just an area where dogs can play freely. He can exercise and play with other dogs. Good. Do you know if there's one near our house? I'm not sure. Why don't you check the internet? All right. Oh, there's one by the river that opened recently. Have a look. Oh, that's really close. That's right. Tomorrow is Saturday, so let's take Charles there in the morning. 14번 대화를 듣고 남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hi, Paula. I'm home. I'm surprised you're still awake. Hi, Dad. I just got home, too. My dance practice ended at 10 p.m. It usually ends at 7, doesn't it? Yeah, but since the dance competition is coming up soon, I had to practice longer. Oh, that's next month. Time really flies. I know. I can't believe it. I'm getting nervous. Don't worry. You'll do great. Just try to stay healthy. Thanks. But right now, I'm so hungry because I skipped dinner. Do you want me to make something for you? That'll be great. Thanks, Dad. I'm a little worried that I'll end up gaining weight, though. Your body needs energy after practicing so hard. Just eat a little bite before going to bed. 15번 다음 상황 설명을 듣고 앨리스가 부모님에게 할 말로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Alice has been working full-time for three months since graduating from college. She likes her job and colleagues very much, but her commute to work is quite long. Her office is on the outskirts of the city and is one kilometer away from the nearest subway station. So, using public transportation has been pretty stressful for her. Alice's parents are concerned about that, so they recommend that she drive their car to work. Alice has a driver's license, but she's not used to driving, and she thinks it wouldn't be easy for her to drive such a long distance to work. In this situation, what would Alice most likely say to her parents? 16번부터 17번까지는 두번 들려줍니다. 16번과 17번 다음을 듣고 물음에 답하시오. Hi, everyone. Welcome to Harry's Healthy Life. We may not know it, but some seemingly harmless possessions we have are actually harmful. Therefore, they should be thrown out. First, antibacterial soap is no more effective at killing bacteria than the regular stuff. And... It may not be safe. The active ingredient in antibacterial cleansers has been shown to alter hormone regulation in animals. Also, most running shoes should be replaced every 300 to 400 miles. When shoes wear down, they lose their cushioning and are less capable of absorbing the impact of your foot landing with each step, which ends up putting you at risk for injuries. When it comes to sunscreen, the expiration date really does matter. The chemicals that block the sun break down over time, so it's not going to protect your skin from premature aging, and it won't reduce your risk of getting skin cancer after expiration date. Regarding cutting boards, slicing and dicing on plastic cutting boards scratches the surface. 
Once bacteria get into those tiny cracks and begin to grow, they can be very difficult to get rid of. Experts recommend switching to wooden cutting boards because wood contains antibacterial substances. Keep all this in mind to maintain a healthy lifestyle. 다시 한번 듣겠습니다. Hi, everyone. Welcome to Harry's Healthy Life. We may not know it, but some seemingly harmless possessions we have are actually harmful. Therefore, they should be thrown out. First, antibacterial soap is no more effective at killing bacteria than the regular stuff, and it may not be safe. The active ingredient in antibacterial cleansers has been shown to alter hormone regulation in animals. Also, most running shoes should be replaced every 300 to 400 miles. When shoes wear down, they lose their cushioning and are less capable of absorbing the impact of your foot landing with each step, which ends up putting you at risk for injuries. When it comes to sunscreen, the expiration date really does matter. The chemicals that block the sun break down over time, so it's not going to protect your skin from premature aging and it won't reduce your risk of getting skin cancer after expiration date. Regarding cutting boards, slicing and dicing on plastic cutting boards scratches the surface. Once bacteria get into those tiny cracks and begin to grow, they can be very difficult to get rid of. Experts recommend switching to wooden cutting boards because wood contains antibacterial substances. Keep all this in mind to maintain a healthy lifestyle. 16번 남자가 하는 말의 주제로 가장 적절한 것은? 17번 언급된 물건이 아닌 것은? 